Howdy, my name is Matias Chavez, I'm part of Joey's group. Hi, I'm Rachel Curry, I'm a part of AJ's group with Team. And here we have the Eddy Current Physics Guillotine. And so what we're going to do is first raise the guillotine up, get it ready to drop, and we're going to introduce our victim here, which is going to be a Coke can. Uh, Rachel's going to hold it up for me, and we're going to place it right here. Okay? And now, if we drop this, as you would expect, it almost cuts through the can. So a lot of force is uh, imposed on this can. Now what we're going to do is introduce an array of magnets here. And place this directly on this plate here, so that when the copper passes, you're introducing that magnetic field. So. And so what's going to happen now is that because the magnetic field is now present in the system, as the blade falls in front of the magnetic field, a changing magnetic flux is going to be introduced to the system. And so um, little currents are going to be generated on this copper plate um, in response to this as according to Faraday's law of induction. Those little currents, called eddy currents, uh, are in a direction such that uh, the resulting magnetic field contribution from those currents uh, impose a drag uh, from the Lorentz force on the system, and which slows it down. And so we're going to demonstrate this here. We're going to have our new victim. Okay. Three. Okay. Yeah. Three, two, one. And so you can see now that the damage on this can is significantly less than on the other one. That was the Eddie Kern guillotine. Thank you for watching.